What's up guys, my name is Potato and this is a new series that I'm going to be doing a vanilla let's play because a lot of you have actually asked me to do a vanilla let's play and Bernie's been yelling at me to, to do it on Beastcraft and uh, for good reason because I, I'm having a lot of fun on this server. There's a good amount of people on here and um, I think a lot of them actually are uh, YouTube people who, um, you know, do their own videos and stuff like that. But, um, this is mainly going to be just a series of me building and kind of relearning the roots of, of Minecraft. If, you know, it's, it's kind of lame to, to, to be able to, or to say that, you know, like I need to relearn how to play Minecraft, but, um, it has been apparent to me for, for a while now, actually, that, um, I don't, I play so much modded Minecraft that it's really hard for me to go back and, um, and play regular Minecraft and, or vanilla rather, and know what the fuck's going on, especially coming onto this server and seeing a ton of people, um, building really technical stuff that, uh, you, you need to do in vanilla. So that's what I'm going to be striving for. So if you guys don't like watching people build things and crap like that, that's mainly what I'm going to be doing for the first few episodes of this. I want to get my 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 nice base all set up if you haven't uh, already seen it. This is a little ice track of mine for when I drop down and I could just speed over to my thing real quick from the top there. Oh shit, my vines are growing up? I didn't know that they grew, that they grew up. Shit, um... Huh. Do I have a... Uh... Let me go make a ladder real quick. Do, 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 do. And, um... Whoop. Come on. No, in the center. There we go. Three ladders. That's pretty cool. It's better than, uh... Than the one you used to get, but, um... Yeah, I already, uh... This is one of the little things that I learned while playing on here was, uh... The, um... Uh, that'll be good enough. The little ice trick thingy, you know? Oh, there we go. That'll work. Just break the rest of these. Okay. And, uh, that should stop the, the vines from growing upwards all the way. See how quick that was? Uh, I'm gonna spare the, uh, the long walk up this thing right here. And I'm just gonna do, uh, slash... No, shit, I think my home is actually... Yeah, it's down here. Damn it. Um, well, let's, uh, let's just roll on back. Uh, there's not a whole lot of commands on here. I think he, we have home and spawn, and that's about it. Um, I tried to make the, uh, the plea for, oh, shit, did I go, I went the wrong way. Um, for home bed, but, uh, Brittany said no. Too, too OP. So, uh, that's fine. That's all right. Um, hmm. Yeah, I need to go back to put my stuff away. But, uh, like I said, this is going to be a pretty vanilla Let's Play. And I mean that in all sense of the words. The few things that I do have on here, I do have Optifine running. I do have, um, what is this, uh, more in inventory tweaks, I think is what it's called. Yeah. And um, just because I like being able to organize stuff real quick and easy. Um, I did have the shader mod, the GL. Or this is the drop right here, by the way. That goes down there to the mine. Um, I did have the GLSL shader mod thing, but I took it off because it's still a little wonky for 1.4. Uh, I was getting really bad film grain, so I'll do some testing with it and then decide if I'm going to do it or not. That and the, the frame rate was really bad. Um, but anyways, this is the castle that I'm working on. If, if you guys follow me on Twitter and Facebook, which you should, you should go do. The, the links are in the description. I've been posting pictures about this. Uh, for a while now, this is going to be the, um, let me turn the sounds down a bit. The new sounds are a little weird. Um, everything sounds really wet, you know? Uh, this is going to be sort of the town place where, um, you know, like, uh, there's, it's going to be very compact and very small where, uh, the townspeople will live, uh, quote unquote, will live. And back here is going to be, um, uh, my castle. I already have the layout of the castle. Um, I guess it's laid out. Uh, get some ender pulls here. In case I want to go up on the mountain. This was my little platform that I saw. I was trying to make sure that this little curve here looked alright. And uh, I'm, I'm okay with that. 
Um, but this is uh, the layout for the castle place. I'm gonna have like a little enchanting table over there. That's all the planning I've done so far. Other than that, I've just done sort of a small little layout. Um, now the music seems really loud. Maybe maybe I'm just being crazy. Maybe my headphones are turned up too loud. I don't know. Um, Hot Rod's having some some trouble or something. But uh, over here is going to be like um, like the mages' quarters. It's gonna have like potions and crap like that but I want this place to be more technical than what, what most of my places are because a lot of my builds since I play a lot of uh, modded Minecraft they don't need to have these large elaborate machines um, that you would need for vanilla because in vanilla you have to do workarounds and stuff like that that's not gonna make it Damn it! this is the um, the way people travel on on beastcraft so I've noticed um, so I've adapted it as well. All right, there we go. Nailed it. Up here was, um, did I leave anything in there? Nope. Actually, in here? Eh, some crap I don't need. I'll take that chest, though. Um, but you can see, this is the, the layout for the castle right here. And the, uh, um, <laughs> rod has been dying all night. Um, it, there's, uh, only Aussies really play on here. That and, um, I know Hot Rod, he said he was from the the land, land of, I think he lives in Europe. I think that's what he said. Uh, I think I'm the last American to actually be playing on the server, so there's hardly anybody on at noon my time. But you can see the uh, the castle, it's looking pretty sweet. I'll show you guys the front here in a second. Um, but that's the castle layout, and then I got some more room over there for uh, for the rest. So that's this is basically going to be... Um, the first few episodes actually it's gonna be a while because it's been taking me a forever to do this little bit right here and I know a lot of you are gonna ask is like well why did I do all this uh, off-camera well I wanted to get a feel down you know like um, when you do a new build and stuff like that it's important to, to figure out uh, the theme that you're going with and I don't know I, I always like the castles that have uh, like the lapis tops and um, thankfully the people here seven up especially he um, he graciously donated a shit ton of lapis for me. Um, oh man, I didn't get any diamonds on that run. I just now realized that. That's okay. Um, I'll take out these bricks. All of these should have a stack of smooth stone, yeah. So uh, we'll be getting to that too at one point or another. Um, I'm out of room. In these chests. <laughs> I don't really have a storage system set up just yet. Um, as you can tell. You know, everything's just kind of all in here. Um, that's another reason why I like inventory tweaks too. Is that I can do shit like that. I'll put those in there. Uh, the chest can go on the other one. Chest in there. And uh, maybe, maybe I'll take that chest back out. <laughs> See, this is this is gonna be basically um, what this series is gonna be. Me, me saying no, 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 that's not good. Okay, well maybe you know, no, no, that's not good. Here we go. Stop putting flint in there. Okay, whatever. This is good enough. I need to show you guys the uh, the rest of the place. Do I have any? Uh more ender eyes, no, or ender pearls rather. Got a couple of diamonds, which uh, I'm pretty happy with, but I don't use them a whole lot because they have this ender farm, which I'll show you guys too, where you can get some badass enchants, and I've been lucking out on it. But anyways, this is a castle. Um, these are like little guard tower things. That's why they got the stone, and they don't really have fancy tops. Um, there's three of them, or you know, six, I guess, if you're counting two each. This has a stone gate. And this is sort of the um, the area where, you know, if the front gate was to get penetrated, uh, people would be in here fighting and stuff like that. That's why it's all gravel. And uh, they shut the big stone gate. And um, Brenny was saying that he doesn't like this, how it's too wide. But I, I don't know. I kind of like it because the front gate should be really heavy, you know, really big. Um, this is where the gate would fall into, you know. Because you don't want it to just stand uh, flat on the ground because uh, there's no support in that, you know? If it's if it's underground, then it could be, you know, pushed up against these sides and it's harder to push back and forth. So uh, that was my little 
solution for that. Plus, I kind of like the, the way it looks. Now that uh, trap doors are flush, it's not not bad. I like it. Um, the inside of this place... Oh, my little sign says potato orgy on it. The inside is very basic. This is also why I was asking you guys uh, what you thought about the, uh, the awnings. And I went with this design because I didn't like anything else being up to, on top of here because it didn't make sense to me that they would have wood awnings. And it didn't make sense to me either that they would have a different type of stone up against their, their building. So I went with the same, the smooth stone stairs because if you, I don't know, I, I try to think of like, well, what would a castle really be made out of? You know, it's like they're going to stay with the same type of stone because obviously they have a shit ton of it and there shouldn't be any different, you know, or it shouldn't diff. I can't say that word guys. I'm just going to skip it. It shouldn't be different. Um, I would be using smooth stone pillars as well if they existed, but they don't. Um, and I kind of like the way the cobblestone fences look as a gate. This this may change also in the future. I'm not sure, but whatever. Uh, spruce floors and stairs. Uh, I have oak trees here, but I've been switching them to uh, spruce logs. Um, it's real simple, you know, like you have access to all the guard towers and stuff like that. There's a uh, glowstone inside of them and on the floor. Um, real easy to get up and get around. Um, but that's about it. I mean, there, there really isn't anything else in here. There is a spawner below this tower that I've noticed. I'll show you guys that later. Um, I want to show you more about the uh, the actual server. So you guys can kind of have a general, you know, understanding of what's going on. This is where I was stationed up, and I have all my spruce trees out here um, planted and such. This building right here, if you guys have been watching, um, or if you watched my other Beastcraft video, which a lot of you did, is my original cake house. And uh, my cake house is still going to be here. Uh, this is a new addition right here. This was my old mine. That was how you got into it, but... Uh, I stopped using it because it was too, it was too, it was, it was painful to transfer stuff from there to here. So it's going to still stay here. And if I ever get uh, more materials that I feel would be fun to add to it, um, I will add to it. But as of right now, oh, damn. Um, it's just going to stay the way it is. Uh, I'm not going to go through all the floors because I've done that before. If you guys want to see the rest of it, um. Just check out the last Beastcraft video I did when we fought the Wither Boss, but it's pretty crazy. I was being, you know, goofy, I guess, um, when I first came on here, because I didn't think I was actually going to keep playing on here, so I just kind of came on to have fun with the guys and meet some of the people that played on here, but um, I do, I've do. i been I've been playing a lot, so I'm going to keep playing. Um, but you can see that's the little drop into the mine down below, and uh, that's about it. Let's eat some cake. And uh, go to spawn real quick. So this is their spawn. Nothing fancy, but, you know, that's okay. Uh, everybody's off doing their own thing. This is uh, Gomez, I believe is his name. His place, I mean, a giant G on it. Um, Death Monk, he, he lives right across the way from my cake house. But I love how you can do the map stuff like this now, you know? Where you can put maps in item frames. It's pretty sweet. But I'll show you the, uh, the Ender Farm. Just so you guys uh, have a grasp of how I got all my sweet enchanted gear and my bitchin' sword, uh, which I love. I've had for a while now, but I haven't really gotten much use out of it. Um, all the stuff that I had when we fought the Wither Boss, I lost all of it because <laughs> uh, I um, may have fell, fall, fallen in lava, and uh, I lost all of it. So I don't know what this place is. I just know that you go in the portal twice and that takes you to the end. Boop -a -da -boo. And then this is where the end portal is. Right here. And someone broke the broke the ladder, so we're here, I think. Yeah. Whoop. Good thing you just jumped through it. I don't know what's up there. Ah, I guess we could go take a look real quick. Oh, it just goes to the surface, okay. So, um looks like there's a bunch of snowmen out here. And, um, oh. Okay, all right, come on. Am 
Well, they can go do whatever, but um, little sand generator thingy down here. And down the stairs we go. It's a pretty long drop, actually. Or There we go. Uh, nope. No one bothered to leave the, uh, the cart that I keep making for this place, but whatever. Yeah. Just ender pearl that way. And we can warp home, so... Ah, oh, shit, I didn't reset my home, though. So I'll just cut that bit out, but, um... See, Rick and 7up, they made this sweet ender farm. With, uh, an enchanting table, a bunch of anvils here. But, uh, it looks like someone was just here, because they just left a bunch of these. Um, it's pretty sweet, pretty simple. I'm not going to keep killing them because it's fucking annoying. Um, I'm sure a lot of you guys already know about Ender Farms, but that's, uh, that's what I have access to here. It's, uh, it's pretty cool. Uh, anyways, I'm going to go back home, and uh, I'll see you guys when I get there. Alright, so back at the at the base or whatever, the, the, the home, home base, the home, home castle base. I don't know what you want to call it. But uh, as you can see he down here, not too far down, we got ourselves a skelly spawner, which is uh, pretty sweet. Um, you're in a lot of zombies. Oh, shit, what? You shouldn't be spawning, motherfucker. Oh, I think someone was down here, because I had torches on top of this thing. Uh, anyways... A little skelly spawner. It sounds like there's zombies or something this way. It's uh coming from this way. Dun 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 dun. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna be coming to you guys for help with uh, design choices and um, actually mainly about like all the cool little gadgets and stuff that these people have on here um, like the mob traps and stuff like that I'm, I'm not gonna look for these zombies right now I do want this coal however um, because it is something that I need to brush up on I am terrible at it I I'm okay with admitting that I used to be decent at it at least um, but uh, since I've been playing mods for so long, it's been really bad. Um, I don't, I don't remember how to make things and do whatever. I can make the old school, like, blade ones, but I hear that's pretty laughable now. So, uh, no, no one's doing that anymore for probably good reason. Um. Damn it. I'm running out of space. I can't even put my dirt in my dirt chest. But uh, this is good enough. I'm not going to actually be working on the walls and stuff because that is um, pretty boring. I think what I'm going to be working on, though, is um, doing this, uh, I guess, little town area or whatever. Um, I need to start working on the buildings that are going to go here. And I was originally going to put farms in here. Like in the first, uh, this first half right here, This um, when you first walk in, it would be farms. And then it would be um, some people's shacks and stuff in the back. And then around the main road would be shops. You know, quote unquote shops. They'd just be themed little buildings. But um, I'm, not, I'm not sure. Uh, shit, I don't even have... Damn it, my fence posts are over there. I haven't put fence posts here yet. Um, that, I don't think I'm going to put wooden doors on the, the guard towers either. I think they're going to be iron doors. A lot of stuff. Um, which is why I'm saying the first few... Um, episodes is going to be uh, basically me chopping down trees and everything like that and forgetting things because since there's no commands to warp back and forth you have to walk everywhere <laughs> not that I'm complaining but I'm complaining um, but that's fine I'll, I'll just have to deal with it like everybody else um, I need to go need to set home first off so I can be around there and then uh, we're gonna go chop down some of the spruce trees that I have because we need wood 
And uh, I think the houses, they're, they're not going to be very big houses at all, by the way. They're, they're going to be very small. Um, I don't even know if they'll, they'll, have, they'll be big enough for beds or not. Um, it'd, be, it'd be nice for the people, the theoretical people that would live there, but, you know, they, who, who says they need beds? Maybe they just fall asleep on the floor, you know, get a nice blanket. Maybe I'll, maybe I'll make a little part of their floor um, out of wool, and then they could just sleep on that. So bear with me as I get my bearings straight in the um, first few God damn it, first few episodes of this uh, this let's play because it's gonna take me some time to to reorientate myself with vanilla let's play. Although I'm very excited because I love building. That, that's honestly that's the thing I love most about Minecraft is building. So, um, very excited to get into this. I'm gonna chop down the rest of these trees. So I'll see you guys in a bit. Um, just gonna do a little little cut right now. Did a pretty good job at chopping down these trees, um, and I replanted a couple of them. And by a couple, I mean quite a bit. I mean <laughs> it's kind of all over the place. Uh, not no rhyme or reason to my planting of trees. Let's take some glowstone with this and um, maybe some of this cobblestone walls and uh, take some stone stairs. Sure, why not? And uh, trap doors. I'm just trying to think of things that I would need or, you know, not need. I'll make some of these into ladders. Oh, I can't make them into ladders here. I do not have a workbench. It's okay. We'll go make one in town. Um, this is, a. Uh, I know I, I kind of, I should probably mention this. This was sort of an idea I had for the corner of the castle walls is just alternating stairs. Um, but it's kind of look like the, uh, the stacked brick look, you know, I kind of like it because it adds more character to the, the straight walls. It's, um, breaks up the monotony or the, the, the neatness uh, of the walls and stuff like that. And then I did it a few times in the, the flat walls here as well where I didn't want to put pillars and these are stairs as well um, I like them I was gonna use some other materials and stuff like that but it's just to find something else that looks good with smooth stone is really tough for me at least I, I can't come to terms with anything so um, that's just uh, where it is so let's put this down um, we'll make a, a little chest as well just uh, just because I'm sure I'm going to need one. I can't put it on top of it without a block behind it. Um, or I'll put some of this crap that I'm not going to be using right now in. Uh, I should go grab some more cobblestone. No, I need my bread. I need it. It's my bread. Oh, damn it. I wanted that to go in my hotbar, thank you. And then i um, probably going to overshoot it, but let's try right there. And boop! Oh, nice. Okay, uh, cobblestone. Take a couple of stacks just in case. We'll take a stack of smooth stone too, just, uh, just in case. You know. You never know when you're going to need it. I just kind of take a bunch of materials and walk out here and try to do a couple of designs. But uh, I'm going to do a couple to leave you guys off with um, just to kind of gauge your guys' reactions um, because I'm not quite sure how I'm going to be building these because uh, the, there is going to be a lot of them. Like I said, this is going to be a very packed area. Um, let's start in the back first and then we'll, we'll work our way inside. So uh, the path leads to about right there okay so let's do something like this maybe uh, the typical cobblestone um, base that a lot of people tend to love and we can do uh, some spruce pillars and uh, we can even take these actually all the way down if uh, we're so inclined but for right now, I think this should be good enough. We'll do, uh, come on, okay. 
The one time I do want a side log. Side log. That sounds funny. Hmm. What am I doing wrong here? See? That that worked. Oh, what? <laughs> Come on now. There you go. Guess I really don't need my axe. My pickaxe is pretty good. We'll do a little cross section here, you know? And then um, bring this back this way. Huh. These aren't as, uh, as dumb as I remember them being. I'll do that, and then uh, we'll put our door right here on this side so we can have a um, you know a window of sorts but this is uh, basically what I'm talking about the houses are gonna be very small um, they're not going to be I forgot to put logs on the back here very big at all because they don't need to be they're supposed to be little peasant houses you know and um, actually I wonder if I should just do a log roof too, like that. See, that's not terrible. This is actually a little bit bigger than I, I wanted to do. Um, I think I was only going to do two. I was going to go one more lower, but I don't know. I don't want to be claustrophobic, you know, in here. i put a window there. Some dirt floors. Because these houses, they're just for decoration. They're not going to be for uh, anybody to actually use. I mean, if, they, if they're so inclined to use this, this they, they can, but um, they, don't, they don't have to. Not that I'm going to ask them to anyways. If they want to, they can. What about that? Smooth stone floor, maybe? Eh, maybe, uh, maybe half slabs of smooth stone. Is that, uh, there it is. But I guess these would be peasant houses. I don't want them to be too fancy, you know? See, that's kind of nice. Leaves it kind of bright or whatever. And I can even put, um,. I could put maybe a chimney in the back over here. So anyways, I'm going to leave you guys with this. Uh, actually, you know what? I'm going to build a couple more. I'm going to make a quick cut. I'm going to build a couple more and then I'll come back and uh, you guys can take a look at, um, at the different styles that I'm thinking about doing. Alright, so uh, I've worked on these for a little while now. Um, and I really do mean a little while. It's been like 10 minutes since the last little cut. But... Um, I think I'm just going to go with uh, keeping all of these random because um, this is supposed to be a really compact and, and um, I don't know, it should be very random, you know, because each house should have its own personality and stuff like that. I have a couple of pictures in here. This one has a pretty nice looking one. And um, I've been using furnaces as um, like ovens sort of deal. I mean, that's what they are. I mean... So I'm using them for what they're supposed to be used as, but I've been using these little cobstone pipes as a as a chimney. And this one uh, I need to replace in the back here. Um, cobblestone right there. Whoop. There we go. Um, oh, I'm gonna be out of cobblestone. Shoot. Okay, let's go get some. Uh, but I've been uh, using this as a way of uh, doing a fireplace type of dealy. And um, I need to bust out that top one too. And these logs. I'll pick those up on my way back. Uh, but I'll show you what I mean here. It has a cobblestone back in and it goes up to the, uh, to, the, to the roof where there's a chimney. Over here has the same one right there. This one's a little bit more spacious, so it has a couple more pictures and stuff like that, but I think each one um, is going to be a little bit different, and I'm debating on whether or not to keep these overhangs, 
over the doors. Um, I kind of like it, uh, but I also like these the the shutters as well because um, you know I just feel like there should be a way for people to be able to shut up their windows, especially since they live right across the street from each other. They don't want to be always having to look into their neighbor's room and everything like that. This one, unfortunately, would not look good with those on because it's too wide. I guess you could make the argument I could bust out this window and put it on this one, but I think each each house should be a little bit different. But I like the cobblestone floor. I think I'm going to tear out the smooth stone floor here and put in cobble because it's a little too nice, you know? Um... These aren't supposed to be nice houses. They're supposed to be cramped, um, small, you know, areas to live in and work in, uh, and all that junk. But um, this is where I'm gonna actually end the episode, guys, because I've gone on quite a bit. I know this episode was a little lackluster because I'm explaining things, you know, showing you guys around the server and doing uh, doing stuff like that. I know I need to go in the back here. Um, there's a skeleton behind me. No? Okay. Whatever. Um, but I promise in the next upcoming episodes it's going to be a little bit um, a little bit more action-packed. And by that I mean not at all because these are not going to be action-packed episodes. They're going to be very slow. And uh, there we go. Uh, there's, there's probably going to be a couple of times where it'll be nice and stuff like that. I also like uh, using the stairs here because it kind of breaks up the roof a bit. Um, I'm not too sure about these logs I thought maybe support beams you know maybe uh, you guys you guys let me know about these logs um, but that's the chimney over there I keep hearing stuff like explode and and break and stuff I wonder if it's just just me being insane um, between episodes I'm probably gonna fill in a couple more of these houses I'll probably do the outside bit and then um, next episode I'm gonna bring it in with the shops in the center and stuff like that uh, leave comments down below of, uh, of shops that should be involved in this little medieval, um, uh, build, I guess. I, I was trying to think of a different word other than build, but, um, you know, just shops that you would see or th th there would be shops there. Just, uh, give me some ideas and then, uh, we'll get started on those next episode. So if you guys like this series, make sure to give it a like. You know, let me know, show me some love. That way I know that I should keep doing this because I do play on here quite a bit now. And I'd really like to share the experience with you guys. So I'll see you guys for the next episode. My name is Potato Orgy and I need an intro that I can say at the end of each one of my videos. <laughs>